bought somebody's father's, deceased father's, shed contents. They wanted to sell everything at once. There's some car stuff, some toys, some clothing, some video games. Um, I would say probably 50% of it is garbage, but uh, there are some good stuff in there. They wanted me to take everything. $100, $100 for everything. They wanted me to take everything, leave nothing behind, and uh, I did it. So I'm gonna go through it, pick out some stuff that I think will uh, will sell, and uh, donate the rest. So I'll show you here in a few. All right, it is uh, Stuff Seller here. It is Wednesday, October 23rd. Just got back from Washington, D.C. on Monday. And uh, I was up there, I was visiting my daughter. And uh, we went to the 49er Washington Redskins game in the rain. It was uh, pretty crazy. It was the mud bowl out there. And uh, got to see a lot of sights. At the end of this video, I will have um, a video of the changing of the guard at the Arlington Cemetery of the Unknown Soldier Tomb. And uh, I have a short clip of that. I'll play that at the end of the video. And uh, for now, I'm going to show you what I sold today. Things that I sold today that I'll be packing up and shipping out. Also, yesterday, I picked up a lot of stuff on Craigslist. This lady was selling a bunch of stuff from a shed. She wanted everything gone at once. She wanted $125 for it. I offered her $100, and I went and picked it up. Initially, I thought it was going to be better than it was. Um, there's some video games in there. There's some toys. There's some electronics, like old CB radio type stuff. Um, I'm going to go through it. I'll show you a, a few things that I, I think are worth showing. Uh, some stuff I already sent to the uh, Goodwill as a donation. I took everything off her hand and I'm keeping some stuff and I'll be listing some stuff. Um, like I said, I don't think it's going to be a huge money maker. I'll definitely make my money back and maybe a little bit of profit. Maybe double my money, hopefully, and uh, go from there. Um, but let me show you what I sold first, and then I'll show you some of the things I picked up yesterday. All right, hold on one second. Okay, so I sold a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, eight items. Um, six that are here. Two I already packed um, yesterday evening, and these items sold this morning, and I'm going to get them packed this morning. So let me go through them. First item is this Tower Records calendar from 1982. It's a long KGB 101. That's a local radio station here in San Diego. Um, they used to play a lot of good rock music. And uh, this 1982 calendar has Tower Records at the bottom. And it has a signature. Obviously, it's a print. But this person, Carson, I believe it is. Frank Carson, 1981 calendar. And I had this listed for 20 bucks, And I ended up taking an offer of $15. $15. And that'll be shipping out today. Next item is this beaded necklace. It is marked made in Italy on the back there. Um, I thought I'd get more for this. I had it listed for like $15 and ended up, I had it listed for a while. Ended up taking a best offer of six bucks and just getting it out of my inventory. Next up are these vintage panties briefs by Warner. I'm not going to take them out of the box. There's two of them in there. It's in the original packaging. Original price was $0.99 cents to $1.25. 
I had these listed for 20 bucks, and I got 20 bucks for vintage panties. Uh, these will be going out today. Next up, if you recall, this was from a garage sale. I paid 50 cents for this thing. It was a keychain. Lady said that she had it since the 1960s. It is a tag, Orient Express, compartment number two. I looked these up. One sold for like $37. So I listed it for $40, bucks, $39.99. I listed it yesterday and it sold this morning, $39.99. 50 cents into $39.99. So that'll be going out this morning. Next up is this little Skippy doll and this was part of the doll lot I think uh, it's the same video where this was purchased where the tag was purchased I picked up a case of dolls this was the first doll that sold I had it at auction for 20 bucks and the reason I only had it for 20 bucks was because she had an arm repair so when you remove the clothing you can see the arm repair um, so I ended up just listed it for $19.99 at auction and received $19.99 buyer paid plus shipping and it's going out today. Lastly is this Harley Davidson bell. It is considered a boot bell. Let me see if I can get the logo here. I think you can see the logo there. Um, I had sold one other one. And I went ahead and listed this one as well. And I received $21. I think they call this a boot bell. So it's new in the packaging. It's going out today. $21 plus shipping. Everything is plus shipping. I also sold that, uh, it's not shown here, I already packed it. It's a Winchester belt buckle. Took a best offer of $20 on that. And a... St. Paul, 1943 St. Paul Ball Club Scorecard. Um, I think I showed that at, on one of my previous videos as well. And I sold, I sold that for $20. And I'll show a picture of it here um, right after this video. And then I will show you what some stuff that I picked up uh, yesterday. All right, hang tight. Okay, like I said, uh, yesterday went and uh, had a Craigslist pickup. Lady was selling everything, and um, she didn't want to piece anything out. So uh, she wanted 125 for everything. I offered her 100. This is only a portion. There's a couple boxes with toys. There is some stuff that I donated to Goodwill already. And uh, this is stuff that uh, I think I'll make my money back plus. Uh, what intrigued me were the games and the controllers. Initially, I thought she had console consoles in there. There were no consoles. It was just the games. So, uh, first up, this little game set, Rummy, Rummy Reese. I'll look this up real quick. It's probably about a $20 game. It's an older game. This is a uh, transformer, uh, speed controllers. I believe they're for RC cars or they're for um, track. Track cars. I looked these up real quick. I probably could get 40 to $50 on this. Timex, Timex uh, Ironman watch. She has some CB radio stuff, so I'm going to have to look some of this stuff up and see what it goes for. This is a uh, huge pictures block. Two-sided. Well-worn. Um, I think it gets pretty good money on it. The only thing is it's heavy, so I don't know about shipping that. But uh, we'll see. 
some car decals in the box. These probably go for about 15 to 20 bucks each. The games, this is probably the best game here, Sonic Generations, $15 game. The rest were pretty much junk. The resort is probably a $10 game. I didn't look this one up. Limited edition Halo 2. And this one is uh, Ben Alien Forces Wii. Uh, PlayStation 2. SpongeBob. And these all have the games in them I checked. Price is right. Hitman Contract. My Sim Sky Heroes and Madden. And then these controllers. This is a Super Nintendo original controller. And the other two, I believe, are aftermarket. Leapster with some games. Uh, a couple of games here for Game Boy. Uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Dragon Ball Z. Didn't look those up. Uh, this little tray was kind of unique. This is a voltometer, voltmeter. I'll have to look that up. Made in USA. Sometimes those go for good money. Some more CB radio stuff. This is a realistic Navajo. I think it's like a $25, $30 radio. And then I didn't look this up. It's some kind of charger. Like I said, there was some more stuff. Not a, not a home run. I'll get this stuff listed and try to recoup some of my money quickly and then uh, sell the rest of the stuff. A lot of the other stuff may be just be uh, swap meat flea market items that I'll take uh, here in the next couple of weeks I'll be going. So this is it for now. I'm thinking about hitting up some estate sales Thursday and Friday and garage sales on Saturday. Hopefully have better pickups. Stay tuned for the changing of the guard at Arlington Cemetery. Stuff seller out. Have a great day. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention, please? I am Sergeant First Class Carney of the 3rd Infantry Regiment, United States Army, Guard of Honor, Term of the Unknown Soldier. The ceremony that you are about to witness is the changing of the guard. In keeping with the dignity of this ceremony, it is requested that everyone remain silent and standing. Thank you.
Thank you. 